Well, the state's campaign, top campaign law enforcer, ruled that the Montana Democratic Party violated some of the key reporting requirements in last year's election. Commissioner of Political Practices Jeff Mangan said the party's report did not identify the candidates it supported with some $300,000 of independent expenditures. Mangan says that is a violation of state law. He also said the party failed to disclose that it would be spending money to support Supreme Court candidate Dirk Sandifer. In 2016, the party's independent expenditures supported both Governor Steve Bullock as well as Sandifer as, and also some Democratic legislative candidates. Now, the political consultant who filed the complaint that led to the ruling says it's ironic that a party often that touts openness in campaigns doesn't follow the rules. The rules are very clear and they say in black and white, you know, when you're going to make independent expenditures to support or oppose a candidate, these are the reporting requirements that are involved and these are the things you have to report so that the people of Montana know <clears throat> who you're supporting and where their support's coming from and all those things and they did not do that. Jake Eaton often consults for Republican candidates. Montana Democratic Party officials say the commissioner's electronic reporting system did not accept some of their filings or who the party supported and that they have now updated that information. Mangan, for his part, says he'll likely negotiate a fine with the party, which said it will work with the commissioner to resolve the issue. Mangan dismissed part of Eaton's complaint, by the way, that had alleged illegal coordination between the Democratic Party and Supreme Court candidate Dirk Sandifer.